Well, welcome back to Vintage Farmhouse Antiques and a really interesting uh, late Victorian platter to show you this afternoon. Not your usual uh, manufacturer. This is by G.W. Turner, who was manufacturing earthenware china in Tunstall around the sort of 1890s. And this, uh, on the dates that we've got, is between 1891 and 1895. So let's have a little look at the marks on the back and show you exactly how we know who and uh, when this was made. Well, here's the rear of that platter. You can see it's got lovely uh, patina with some wear just around the basal rim, as you'd expect. And here's the first of the big clues as to who made it. Thank you for that. Sorry, I've got a pair of puppies playing with each other in the background here in the studio. Turner with uh, a lovely impress mark. And above that, let's get this the up, uh, it's upside down. <laughs> there we are, rotated for you. Just make out Turner along the top there. Royal crest with the lion and unicorn and uh, Tunstall England below it. Typical Turner marks and these were used for the period 1891 through to 1895. So let's have a little more detailed look at this platter, its rims and the design. Now, as you can see here, sometime in its life, just get that in focus, this platter has been in an iron uh, holder, a, a plate rack or a, a wall holder. You can see those two wear marks there, characteristic across the top of this platter. But apart from that, the actual surface is in incredibly good condition. Let me get this back onto uh, this dresser and get it in focus. I think the design is oriental poppies, if you uh, make out this one particularly here. It's in a very gentle, characteristic, hey, you two, behave, late Victorian uh, romanticised floral design. Two blocks of transfer pattern, one at each uh, oblique corner of this platter, and they're in very nice condition. The surface itself, as you can see by the glazed reflection, again, is in very good condition, if I can get this to uh, reflect some light, hardly a knife mark on it. And the glaze itself, absolutely fine. No crazing, no cracking, no damage whatsoever. So the only condition note really relates to uh, its pattern, which are those rubbing marks from its uh, wire stand where it's been displayed. An absolutely fantastic piece. Turner's not a particularly common or prolific manufacturer. To find a piece in this condition from this age is really very unusual and rare. 15 and a half inch by 13 inch. So I hope we've given you some idea of the scale and condition of this piece. Really is a fine piece for collectors of grey and white, late Victorian, English China. Thanks for watching. Yeah, that's what all the noise was about. I do apologise.